Hi, I'm Klaus from Datacolor. Today we're in a billiard saloon to introduce you to our raw calibration tool, the Spider Cube. As a photographer, you know the challenges of finding the right settings in different light situations. No matter if you're shooting outdoors or in the studio, if you can't analyze the light in your image, you won't get quality results. RAW gives you the best quality and control, but post-production is like playing pool. You need to deal with the white, with the black, and with the different colors. Post-production in RAW is all about using the right techniques to get things easily done. All you have to do is place the spider cube in the lighting conditions under which you will be photographing. This photo will capture important information about the light conditions that you will need for the RAW adjustments. Let's see how it works. Adjusting RAW images. Open the image containing the spider cube in your RAW processing software. Make sure to activate the warning function for under and over exposure. Step 1. White balance. Use the white balance tool to set the color temperature. This will also set the tint. You do it by clicking on the gray section of the spider cube. Choose the brighter one as it represents your primary light source. Step 2. Exposure. Adjust exposure so that none of the color channels are clipped on either side of the spider cube. Step 3. Brightness. Brightness can be adjusted to compensate for lightning or darkening that occurred during exposure adjustment. Check the midtones using the gray area of the spider cube. This is 18% gray and can be used to determine how light or dark image midtones should be. Step 4. Blacks. Finally, Set your black levels using the black level eyedropper if your software offers one by clicking on the black trap. If your software does not have a black level eyedropper, set the black slider to show a clear distinction between the blacks in the black trap and that on the surrounding black face. Save your generated settings and use them as custom settings for your other raw files which you shot under the same light conditions. Wait, what? <laughs>